So the rain is pouring down here at the seawall but I stopped here to get some hot dogs. Everything. So in the hot dog is carrot, um, seems to be pick, sweet pickles and cheese and mustard. So let me give it a try. Very delicious, tasty hot dog. So this is one of the food that you can try here by the sea wall. So what do you have a favorite? Right now we just had drink, but you see the hot dog popcorn, coffee can, and the other. I'm also I would like some chips. Yeah, let me get one. Yeah. So I'm getting some cotton chips. And if you do it by yourself, right? If you do it by yourself? No. You buy it? Yeah. Um, still it plugs empty. Uh, so I'm getting some carton chips here. Yeah. Yeah, I never expect him to fall. Follow me, come back. Oh, so you dip it in the sauce and then from the sauce to the pan. They're gonna close it down and let you stay at the side. You know the air though. <laughs> you are gonna run me out of business. Ah. <laughs> so we take it out from the steam just so and we sell it just so. So some oh. people always want it two way. Yeah. So that's the case with this with the soil. Yeah. Right? And we sell it rose just so just steam and rose so just like that. Okay, okay. okay. Sorry. So if you add in the sauce to the chicken, yeah. So right off the grill, nice sweet barbecue. And from the grill, come out here. So I'm having some nice barbecue to eat. Yeah. So I'm just now be trying the barbecue chicken that I just cooked. And I get it with some nice salad here. See? And to go with it. Some pasta. You know the name of the place? Come, you try it. The dog is gonna try it. They've got the chicken. Oh, is it? It's good. Nice, you try it. I think I want it. It's good. Alright, so I'm at um, original Latino fast food. Okay, so I'm going to try the what's that? Aria Pan chicken. Aria Pan chicken and also the 
kebab. Yeah, and the chicken kebab. Huh? I'm gonna try the beef curry kebab. Yeah, so I get in my food now and select like the hands some nice um, barbecue chicken and I also have a nice sitting area. So the are for Indian Houston, no? So the first thing you do is that you use the corn flour and then you make it in a mold and you fry it and what you do now? We cook the inside, the chicken side. Okay. And this is a popular dish in Venezuela? back in Parika but this has more um cross to it. Mm. <laughs> okay Dorothy. What do you think about Very tipsy. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah, you enjoy it. Nice. Okay. You enjoy it? Tell me what you think about it. It tastes good. It tastes good? Yeah. Alright. Yeah, so I just get my kebab now. Beef kebab. Alright. So this is it. So the kebab is, is tasty. Um, it's beef. I think that a bite of too much at one spill up on bowl, but it is delicious and you can try it out. The beef is tender. It's not too trashy, and I like that about it. So the kebab is a recommendation. Dark with an egg.
food already. Let's go in 
So this one is a bit messy but it's worth it, it's delicious. You should definitely come and try it. It's bigger than my mouth, so when I, it's all over your face, but the taste of it is delicious. Look at it. This was gaining seafood along the sea wall. I'm planning to do a part two for this because there are so many places I couldn't cover them all. I really enjoyed the Venezuelan dishes and the barbecue was top notch. Everything was just so awesome. I tried the dishes from the Venezuelans were the first time I was trying them and I'll be heading to Venezuela soon. They were delicious. Uh, Uwe, what do you think? I really enjoyed the kebab from the Venezuelan stall and the barbecue was amazing. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment down below what you think and comment down below where I should go next. Peace be with you.